medical marijuana might be controversial, but it is coming to Pennsylvania. More than 500 companies are applying for just 12 licenses to grow and process medical marijuana in this state. And that's why this conference is pushing out all the information the public needs to know. Knowing cannabis treatment and how it works, researchers say cannabis is the parent plant. It produces the marijuana plant used medically for pain and inflammation. The cannabis also produces the hemp plant used for neurological conditions such as epilepsy. Dr. Stuart Titus is the founder of Medical Marijuana Incorporated, the first publicly traded company in the United States to produce medical marijuana. He says it's the counterpunch to opioids to treat pain. They were seeing that in the medical cannabis friendly states, the incidence of opioid overdose deaths are 25 to 30 percent lower. Here's how Pennsylvanians will access cannabis treatment. Patients must receive recommendations from doctors with the physician's state issued credentials. The patient must receive a state issued ID card. It looks like the driver's license, like this California card issued to Dr. Titus. And then the patient purchases the prescribed cannabis products from state licensed dispensaries. It certainly is one of the great growing uh, growth industries in America, if you will. Uh, there are now 30 states uh, because West Virginia just legalized.